So I found some movies on this camera but they were kind of bogus so I make my own. Uh, I just cut the seal of the box. Uh, it's a Sony HDR CX240. The European uh, PAL version. Uh, plenty of manuals. I've only downloaded the online version. Here's the camera, pretty much smaller than my old one. A plastic feeling, light charger. It looks like one of the common USB chargers. There's 5 volts. Um, 1. 5 amps so it's a little bit better than the USB 2 but almost as the USB 3 in charging HDMI cable and this should be the USB extension wire so this is it yeah the battery of course I think this is good because I have uh, one of the Sony action cams and it's the same battery so if I get one hour from this I can use the other one as a spare. So let's start it. I charge the battery and oh the lens cover. Uh, um, I set it to 50p, but it was some kind of hidden menu. I first had to choose the highest quality uh, recording, until, and uh, after that uh, I got this uh, 50p menu, uh, the 2.8 megabytes per second. It's 28 megabit uh, indicating. Uh, indicated on the screen so with a 32 gigabyte card I get about two hours of recording time but the battery will last about an hour so how do you show the display then no it was the play menu here yeah, 2.39 yes and then when I cat likes to be a free movie star so yeah to back off back off you have to check how to look at it no, you're spoiling my movie. So, if there's any, I'd like to see the. If there's any any guidelines and and all the display items, I'd like to see them while shooting. So, I might have to go through the setup too, maybe. Most of the settings I, I haven't uh, changed anything, so uh, maybe I have to uh, cancel the the steady shot because I'm usually shooting fast moving objects and 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 uh, on the distance they usually jump all over the screen when panning. So uh, sometimes those uh, stabilization systems don't work for me. And the digital zoom is off, but I think that was default. Uh, maybe this should be shut off too. Yeah, I changed the mic to zoom mic. Let's see how it works later then. A grid line, here we have them. I'd like to turn it on. That's always also something not so consequent because sometimes you get the confirmation okay here in the lower uh, right of the screen and sometimes you just push okay and okay in the other corner. So now we have the grid lines. So this is the first shot. I'm gonna test the all of how to focus on some bricks. Uh, 20 meters away. This is the full zoom extended. 
a no tripod that is just handled and I think it's working pretty well. Also I'm shaking a bit. Some other stones to use gravel in the comp. We're moving back to the balcony. In the same shaft with the low lux on. It's amazing. It's pretty dark but it really enhances. You can see the bricks. Somewhere here it gets a little bit dark and my hand is shaky so I should have used the tripod. My next time need to full tell it. Otherwise it's a great camera. Well, this is my old Canon camera. Um, Fragile. Shoot the same. Seeing us with the new Panasonic. This is as far as the tele goes. So I don't know. It only has ten times zoom. So.